the normal question. Have you a wife? No. Have you a girlfriend? No. Do you want a wife? No. Are you gay? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> they do not they did not ask you, who are you? No. But in case they realise that some stupid old foreigner on a, a motorbike. But one of them, she had twinkly eyes for me. She took with her phone. She didn't think I noticed, but she took me a photo of me. So I should ask her for money, eh? <laughs> so you're not the one to look for your uh, young sister in the market? No, I've searched for 75 this month. I was married many, many years ago. Uh, I think we were maybe uh, 30 years ago. And really, I'm still in love with my wife, although she's not in love with me. <laughs> so you're not after that divorce, you're not uh, yet married? No, I, I'm not interested. I, I, but you have children. My son is 40, and my daughter is 36, and I have grandson 11. Yeah, that's all, all uh, living right now in the uh, US. No, they're living, I'm not married. I'm Ukrainian. Ukrainian? Yeah. How is uh, Prime Minister, uh, oh, President Bolotsky? Zelensky. Zelensky. Well, he's okay. Huh? Uh, Russia is really destroying my country. Yeah, I think Putin will be, will be put there and taking off. Putin, the problem is, if Putin is deposed, there are many, many crazy, extremely right Mehadev, who was president for four years, he uh, put in game in the job for four years, the war was in line. He's basically he got to attack the West with nuclear weapons. And oh, so you prefer Putin for Russia? <laughs> right now? No, I don't prefer him. I, I say, if he was killed or whatever, there's any number of crazies to take his place, so he would do nothing. We cannot understand why they're fighting us. Uh, it's just a very bad situation. And they have destroyed So there's no peace negotiation going right now? Between how can we the, the, the NATO country? No. The well, they, people are talking about peace. What we want is Russia to get out of Ukraine, our country to just get out. Stop fighting and get out. And then stop. We didn't start this war. We started the war. But we have to. They look like that uh, February attack. Uh, oh, no, that's terrible. Yeah. But he got a surprise because he thought it will only take weeks. Days? <laughs> only, but uh, only two years from now. Yeah, but we're Cossacks. We're fighters. We know the Cossacks. Yeah. Horse riding swordsmen. <coughs> and we defend, take, we defend <coughs> our country. <coughs> so, how about the two boxers right now? Ukrainian boxers. Are they fighting for Russia? Uh, for Ukraine? One is and one is the mayor of Kiev. Yeah, that's uh, a Yeah, yeah, let's go. His brother is doing something with the army, and he is doing good job. He's, he's trying to defend his city. How about the uh, the other back there? Oh, the, he's now the world champion. You yeah, mean? yeah, he's uh, he gave everyone a surprise. We surprise people. Actually. We're uh, something that surprises people. I hope there will be peace there. And well, then the only way we will get peace. We are also a bit good here because uh, some of our products came from uh, Ukraine. Yeah, of course. The gas, the wheat, well, the that's, flour. That's the problem. You know, the World Food Program gets most of their grain for the starving people in Africa from us. Yeah. The natural gas is a uh, rich in natural gas. Yeah. Well, we're rich in many resources. Um, this is why Putin would like to take it. Well, he already is holding 20% uh, of our country. And stealing Kherson, which is south, he's stealing all the grain from there. Kherson? Kherson is the region. How about the, the, that one? Uh, Crimea? Yeah, Crimea? No. Uh, they took Crimea and they took the harbour. Okay, nice meeting you. And you. June. David. Ah, uh, June. Yeah. Another June. I know many June. <laughs> no, Junior. Junior. Oh, yeah, Junior. Yeah, my name.
Definitely stopping now. Sorry, folks. Oh, well, hang on. Are you still running? This is the point. No. Yes. This, I'm determined to see these people catch some fish and go round and round in circles. If you're still running, as you are, I'll leave it on for a bit. But I'm hungry. Coming back. These spotters normally know what they're doing, so decided the splashes and everything was not enough. You're going round and round, you're making me dizzy. <laughs> Where's the beach? Madam, don't fall off, eh? <laughs> don't fall off. I heard. Yeah, I'm sure you are. He's taking you round and round like a circus. Uh, what's yeah. Are you sure he knows what he's doing? Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> the lady's proud, I would think she is. day I haven't had a swim. Getting lazy. I try to swim double tomorrow. I think Rose broke up my morning routine by coming down twice. I'm going to put your bike in the car. I said, I can ride up. No, no. And it's not that big a car, but she knows how to fit a bike in there. So left the uh, hatch open and it fits perfectly, but deprived me of eight kilometers uphill cycling, which is good exercise. over there. Harry Enfield. Don't do it like that. Do it like this. I try not to be like that. <laughs> Sometimes I am. Oh, 
I will sing for you. The water is deep, I cannot get o'er, nor have I wings with which to fly. There you are. Pay me. <laughs> I want to go home for breakfast but you're making me stay here for watching the fish. Hey, some breakfast for us. <laughs> Where? There. You want McDonald's? Yeah. <laughs> the new market eatery is very good. Okay. I will get you beef stack tagalog. Beef stack tagalog. All right. I'll wait for you. Yeah, in a while. <laughs> Such a good sense of humour. And you know, you need one if you've been out half the night, rocking in boats. Oh, here comes a monster coming up. be really great if before you run out of film and I've got the camera the wrong way around David wakey wakey I'm going to put you up here because of the so I'll walk you up here a bit 